this is why you need to lock in. This is why I need to lock in. Apologies if you hear my mum walking up and down on the phone. She's on my phone to my auntie and just talking, you know, what mums do. But this is why you need to lock in. Like, seriously, seriously lock in. Because there's more of a chance that you are going to fail and not live the life that you want than there is of you succeeding and living the life that you want. For example, people don't make an effort to fail. People don't intentionally fail. For example, you don't have to do anything for you to fail. But for you to get the type of lifestyle that you want and the type of success that you want, you have to do something. And it's harder to do something and it's easier to not do something. So sometimes you might catch yourself in a cycle or in a loop or in a situation where you're not actually doing anything. But you don't realise it until you actually consciously think of it. And then over time that compounds into you actually failing over a period of time. Um, another reason why you need to lock in. By the way, when I'm saying this to you, I'm, I'm speaking to myself. Another reason why you need to lock in is because time is running out. It's get, I don't want to say it's getting harder and harder for people to create wealth because I don't have any evidence to, to back that up. But time is just ticking. Like for me, I'm 22. I'm 23 in two months. Before you know it, I'm going to be 24, 25, 28, 30, 32. Like high school feels like it was the other day. But really, high school was time ago. Um, I don't want to be in a place where I'm like 27, 28. I'm still trying to do X, Y, Z. I'm still trying to get the ball rolling. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I think from the ages of like 16, 17 to about 22, 23. In between that bracket there, people will cut you some leeway. Like, whether you're working, you're trying to find a job, whether you're in corporate, whether you're an entrepreneur, you're starting a business, you've got a small business, big business, whatever it is, right? People will always cut you some slack because you're young. They don't really have much expectations of you. But you see, once you hit that 23, 24, 25 plus mark, in my opinion anyway, it's no longer potential. It's now expectation. For example, if someone does something very well at 26, 27, like, yeah, congratulations, but I expected that. If you move out, okay, yeah, I expected that. You're 26, 27. Do you know what I mean? So, as you're young right now, if you are young watching this, or young is subjective, but if you are below the ages of, like, 23, 100% use your age to your advantage. Another reason why you need to lock in another reason why I need to lock in is because there's a higher chance of you getting left behind especially if you are someone that has a lot of entrepreneurial friends friends that are into business maybe as friends that are just working good jobs and are climbing up the corporate ladder if you don't sign in and lock in and do what it is that you know you're supposed to do people are going to leave you like nobody wants your lifestyle for you more than you like, all of my friends, yeah, I want them to go and create the lifestyle that they want, but I don't want that for them more than they want it for themselves. For example, I might not go out of my way to go and help them every single day. I'm probably not going to do that because I've got my own life to worry about. You don't want to be in a place where three years, four years down the line, your same friends that was once on the same boat as you, they're clearing you, making way more money than you. Their business is way bigger than yours. They're probably building families now they're just way more successful than you are and it's not to say that it's a bad thing if they are but it's a bad thing if you are still relatively in the same position and they're gone not clear but they're way ahead of you because if they were able to do it there's no reason why you weren't able to do it or unable to do it but you was probably just procrastinating you was being lazy you was being consistent with your bad habits you wasn't making the effort to do the right thing like there's so many things only you would know where it is that you're supposed to do and what you should be doing. For me, only I would know because only I know what my habits are. But if you don't lock in like properly, 
the chances of these things happening is very real.